Hi, this is Tony from ministrytochildren.com. In this video, I'm going to show you a painted cross craft that we were doing here at church with our kids. Now, this is a great craft anytime leading up to Easter or anytime you want to talk about the theme of atonement and salvation. For supplies, kids. you're going to need the pattern off our website here. And I've printed that on resume paper with 100% um, cotton linen finish. You can also use plain paper. Kids paint, cotton balls, a paper plate, wipes, paper towels, and I've got this special tape. It's scotch uh, drafting tape. Okay, for this example, I'm only going to use a little bit of paint. And another option for this, I'll show you in a minute, if you have preschoolers and you're afraid of paint, this is the washable paint, but you can also use uh, colored markers and do about the same thing. So you um, put the drafting tape and the shape of a cross here, and then you tell the kids to just dab and trace the outlines of the cross. Now be careful to spread the paint all the way around or you'll get big blotches that won't dry very easily. Like this. Put some green down here for the hill. Another option would be to tape over the Bible verse so it wouldn't get uh, painted as well. But I didn't think of that until just now, so you're kind of stuck with this example. And dab that around, and the kids, you know, will take their time and do it however they like. Okay, after you've had time to dry, just come and you peel back the masking tape. And there you go. Um, the alternate would be with the markers, and you get an example of that. Oh, you didn't do that. Oh, those. Smile, Chloe. Okay, when that was all said and done, it was a lot of fun. It took me a few tries to actually get it right. A few tips for you. Make sure that that masking tape, you do that in advance for the kids. Even fourth and fifth graders have a hard time tearing the masking tape and applying it in the cross shape. So do that in ahead of time and make sure the edges are sealed properly because as the moisture would get under the tape, um, and when you would peel the tape away later, the paper would deteriorate and tear away with the tape. So make sure that you get a good seal, and if possible, have the kids go light on the edges of the cross. Uh, the marker idea is pretty attractive, but it has the same problem with moisture under the tape, and I tried a few different varieties of tape and a few different varieties of paper, and that was still a problem, so keep the moisture out. Um, otherwise, this was a lot of fun, and I let it dry at least overnight and wiped up the stuff the next morning, and it was a great craft idea. So hopefully that will be useful to you in your ministry.